Hi everyone, welcome to Ketu Blogging and in this video we will talk about the Merchant WooCommerce plugin. So Merchant is a WooCommerce toolkit plugin that comes with 35 modules to improve the user experience on your e-commerce store. It will help you improve the sales and reduce the card abandonment rate. So let's check how you can use this plugin to supercharge your WooCommerce store in WordPress. So let's check the feature of this plugin. So this is the merchant plugin and here you will get a lot of functionality. So if you check, you can add a frequently bought together option in your WooCommerce store or you can see like buy one get one free option like this and you can set the volume discount like this. You can set a spending goal here. You can offer free gift in your WooCommerce page or you can take pre-order for out of stock inventory. And here you can also add a sticky add to cart bar at the bottom of your screen or you can add a countdown timer to your WooCommerce store. You can also add a stock scarcity like it will check the total number of inventory count in your WooCommerce settings and it will show that like five products left in your store and you can also add a waitlist functionality like this. So if a product is out of stock then it will add a email box so you can input that email box and when the product get this get into the stock it will send a reminder to that user and you can also set a checkout page like this so you can get multiple checkout pages for your WooCommerce store and you can also add a recently view product to your store as well so here you will get a lot of options like that is advanced review you can add buy now button you can add product label you can add a animated add to card option you can add a quick view option as well so we will go through each of the options uh, in the dashboard and here you can see that you can see floating mini card like this or you can add a card reserve timer like this and you can card count fabricant in active tab manager so here you will get a lot of options in this plugin so as you can see that you can add a side chart to your e-commerce page you can add videos to your products you can add audios you can add a login pop-up like this like you can add social media logins and everything and you can add a waitlist functionality like this you can add variant product swatches like you can change the color sizes to in your products and you can also enable ajax real-time search so it will eliminate a lot of unnecessary plugins in your store and this plugin will help you do all the customization in your woocommerce store within a single plugin and you can also add a scroll to top button and you can also use it as a code manager plugin in your website and it also adds some cookies banner and agree term and condition like this so here you can see that it has replaced all of the plugins like add buy now button quick view you can see the product batches or pre-order fabricant counter so it will replace all of the plugins with a single plugin so let's check how this plugin work so i have already installed this merchant plugin here as you can see that so after installing this plugin you will see this option merchant so let me just click on here and here this is the interface of this plugin and here you will see all of the modules here so let's scroll down here and you can see this green dot marks that means this module is activated so you can see the total number of module activated here so let's click on here and as you can see that there is total 37 modules and out of 37 23 modules is activated in this website so here we have activated the advanced review so let's click on here and as you can see that it will add a review section like this so it will make your WooCommerce store looks professional so it will show the total number of graph style reviews like it will show the total number of 5 star 4 star and user can sort the reviews here you can change everything from here like you can change the title here you can change the HTML tag you can also hide this title if you want you can set the title alignment to left right or center so you can set the default ordering here you can change the color according to your brand color so you have all the controls here in this block so let me just show you how it looks so let me just open a store here and let me open a product here and here it is so it is saying that there is no reviews 
so let me just write a reviews here so let's keep it like five star and i will add like very good like this let me just submit this review and as you can see that the review is added here and you can see it is showing the graph like total number of five star four star reviews in this product so this is how this advanced reviews blog works so in this way you can just easily enable any module in your website with a single click so let's start with the buy now module here and here as you can see that there is this buy now button added to the site so let me just enable this module here and let me just refresh this page again and as you can see that there is a buy now button added to your um, product pages so if you click on the add to cart button it will add to the cart but if you click on the buy now button it will directly redirect to the checkout page so user can directly check out this option and as you can see that this checkout page is also so looking a little bit different so i will talk about that later in this video so let me just go back again and if you go to the shop page you will see this buy now button here as well so user can directly buy a product by clicking on the button so you can easily change the color of the button border color background color and everything from here so suppose you want to change the button background color so you can change it to something like this so once you change this settings just click on the save button here and it will reflect in your front end so let me just refresh this and as you can see that the buy now button is now added so let's change the border color to something like white let's save this and let me just refresh this and as you can see that the buy now button color is changed so if you click on the product and here as you can see that the color is changed here so in this way you can easily enable any module in this plugin so let's check this option animated add to cart so let's me just add here and here you can enable this option as well now you can change different animation style like this you can add a bounce effect like this or you can add a zoom in effect like this or you can add a shake effect to your buttons so here this is the pulse so let's add a bounce effect to our add to cart button like this or you can set the activation animation activate this animation on mouse over or on page load so i will set it as mouse over so let me just save the settings now let me just refresh this page and as you can see that this bounce effect like this is added with a single click now you can add different modules like this so there is a quick view module so let me just show you so when you click on the quick view button it will start a quick preview of this product so let me just enable this quick preview button here now let me just go to the shop page here and here you will see this option quick view so let's click on here and as you can see that it has loaded the preview like this so you can easily view any product here like this and you can easily add to cart in this product so this is how the quick view works so let's go back here and there is the product level so you can show a product levels like this like special spring special winter special or you can display the sales percentage if you want so let me just change it to sales percentage here let me just enable this module and let me just save these settings now let's go to the shop page here and let me just refresh this page and here you will see a discount like this so let me just go to this product here and here let me just add a discount in this product so for this what i can do is i will go to the watermelon glow so let's go to the product all products and i will edit this product from here and let me just go to the inventory here so let's add a sale price of 10 so let me just update this and here we have set the regular price to 14 and we have set the sale price to 10 so let me just refresh this page here and as you can see that it is showing the 29 percent discount on this product and this regular price is 14 dollar and we have changed the sale price to 10 dollar so it will start showing a level like this in your product as well so in this way you can add a product label as well now let me just go to the merchant plugin again and here you can see different options 
like you can add a checkout option like this so let me just click on here and here you can add different type of checkout style in your WooCommerce store one is the Shopify multi-step so it will divide this step like this or you can add a one step like this so it will add a payment method right within the checkout page or you can add a multi-step like this so it will start showing the billing and shipping then it will show the order and payment and then the order review so let me just save this now let me just go to the checkout page here so I will click on checkout here and here you can see that so let's click on proceed to checkout and as you can see that the now the checkout page is changed so in this way you can add different checkout pages to your WooCommerce store as well so you can fill all the details here let me fill some details here let me add some zip code here let me add phone number like this so let's click on next step here and as you can see that it is showing the order payment like this so it will show the all the products and its price and let's click on next step here and as you can see that you can review the order and then you can place the order from here so in this way we can change the checkout page as well in your WooCommerce store using the merchant plugin so let's go to the shop here and let's go back here and let's check the other modules that comes with this plugin like you can show a recently view product here so let's click on here so this will help you increase your conversion in your WooCommerce store so as you can see that it is enabled here and it will show the recently view products so let me open some products from here and you can see that it is start showing the recently view product as well so it will show a related products like this and it will show the recently view products so let me just visit a different product and let's check if this product is showing in the recently view or not so let's click on this here and you can see that we have enabled we have visited this order and let me just open a different product here as again and as you can see that we have seen that we have uh, recently viewed this product and it is listed in the recently viewed products so in this way you can give a personalized touch to your woocommerce store and improve your conversion rates so let me just go back here and as you can see that we have added different modules here as well using this plugin like you can buy one get one option in your plugin you can add a buy three discount module like this so here you will get a lot of options and there is this sticky add to cart button is added here there is the floating cart button like this or you can add a save option like this so here you will get a lot of options there is a free gift option here as well so using this plugin you will get a lot of options also let me just give an overview of this blocks here like you can show a waitlist functionality in your WooCommerce store you can add a stock scarcity here so let me just click on here and as you can see that it will say like 20 unit left in your stock so you can enable that as well and here you can add pre-order so you can add buy x get y you can see the gift as well and here you can see card count fabrican inactive tab manager so here you can set payment logos trust badge product brand images and reasons to buy list and you can see auto external link real time search so you can enable this option as well so it will search the product so whenever user type a product name it will automatically list out the related products right within the search box so you can also enable that as well using this plugin and let me just scroll down here you can add a code snippet as well so if you want to add code to your header footer or something you can add this code here as well so this will work as a code manager plugin as well so you don't have to use a different plugin for that and here you can add product videos so once you enable this option it will give the option to upload videos in the product list and you can see the side chart as well so you can display a side chart like this and it will show the us eu uk side chart like this so here you need to enable this module 
which you feel is missing in your WooCommerce store using this plugin. You can also add a product swatch as in your WooCommerce store as well using this plugin. So these are the list of blocks that you get in this plugin and the plugin is very affordable. So it will cost you around $64 per year and it will replace a lot of plugins and you can see the free and pro comparisons of this plugin as well. So in free version, you will get like free order module. You can set buy now product label, animated add to cart, quick view. So you will get some free options as well like cart, count for Recon inactive tab manager and you can see so trust badges payment logos and you can add real time search so in free version also you will get a quite lot of blocks and if you want to unlock everything then you have to purchase the pro version so i will include the link of this page in the description so you can go and check out this plugin so i definitely recommend this plugin as it will reduce a lot of plugins in your woocommerce store and do all of the things in a single plugin so if you found this video helpful then make sure to hit the like button and if you have any doubt regarding this plugin then you can ask me in the comment section and i will see you in the next one bye bye